Make sure to hop on over to medicadomani.com for exclusive giveaways, newsletters, and news for all things Italian American. That's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> What's up, everybody? We are here. We have some special guests today. We have the Betty twins, reoccurring guest Rosella. She's actually helping me co host today. Yeah, you needed a little female energy. We need a little Sfoyadel, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know? This is a Definitely. lot of brajol energy. <laughs> a, lot of testosterone. There's a, lot of, a lot of big yeah. brajol energy. We got the twins, John and Tony, yep. all the way from England here with us today. How are you guys doing? Fantastic. Yeah, happy to be here. Yeah, happy that you guys are yeah. here. So, Rosella messaged me and she's like, I got these two great kids from England, Italian, English. You got to interview them. I'm like, all right, only if you interview with me. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I'm their agent now, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, put put the mic agent. closer to you. For, for any future or, bookings, you know, just oh, hit me Rosella. up. Second, yeah. For any future um, New York bookings, see Rosella. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Brooklyn ones especially. <laughs> especially the Brooklyn ones. I'm just making sure our audio levers are good here. All right, um, so what brings you guys to New York? So we was, um, we've been cooking on today sauce um, so for years now, and obviously after the pandemic, um, we're back on from rolling. So we was cooking on the today show yesterday on NBC, which was great fun. Um, obviously, come on to do the podcast. So yeah, uh -huh. we love that, that accent is amazing. Yeah. <laughs> but we're like we're from Manchester. We're not like you expect when you say English, you think like Prince William, that kind of London uh -huh. accent and things like yeah. that. But we're from the north, so ours is a bit muddled. Yeah, we get, we get Scottish right, a lot. You can yeah. barely understand anything yeah. they say, but it doesn't exactly. matter. But I gotta like, be honest listening? when I. I'm alone. I always do like an English accent. I'm like, really? what's up, mate? Would like a cup of tea? Me and my brother only talk in an English accent. Yeah. It's terrible. Yeah, it How's yours? So Let me hear yours. No, I can't do it. Go on, Rosella. No, do I can't do it now. No, I can't. Now I'm on nervous. Spot, do it. You have to. No, 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 no. I got to be inspired. You're like in the middle of an English sandwich right now. Yeah. You don't do it Off now. Go. When are you going to do it? You have to name a sandwich at Anthony's after this situation. Yeah. yeah. It's what, the, gotta be like... The twins... The, the, know, you gotta the, make a sandwich. I don't know. Yeah, what, yeah what, we need to come up with one. So if I was a deli... If I was a, a, a deli meat, I'd be mortadella, right? Like, mortadella is actually like bologna. I know. It's a time bologna. Like <laughs> you, I thought you would be like prosciutto de parma or something. Really? Oh, like. that's not, that's so you'd be the spicy one. Spicy super yeah. Oh, spicy super, super sad. Yeah. There you I go. Spicy super, really? I don't know. Spice is super size. You gotta come yeah. up uh -huh. with something. Yeah, you gotta throw something. Slice in. thin, you know? Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, like a spicy sopra yeah. sata banger sandwich. Yeah, the yeah, that'd the be good. Yeah, the twin banger. The twin banger. The twin banger. There we go. Not the number one seller, that. Best and seller. now, guys, um, <laughs> make sure to subscribe to our OnlyFans uh, growing up a time. <laughs> 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 um, so, yeah, you, guys, you guys out. started with like a reality TV show, right? Yeah, yes. like we, obviously we come from an Italian family. We we're born in England, hence the accent. But yeah, we come from an Italian family. Always been surrounded by food and cooking. That's mm -hmm. something we've always been passionate about. Uh, but yeah, later on when we got older, the Love Island came around. You don't have Love Island here, right? That we do. We do. We do. We do have Love Island. We no? had it for like a minute, but it wasn't good. So it really? was like, no. It's very popular in England. Yeah, um, so yeah Australia. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Rosella has a name of what it should have been it called. It should have been yeah, called yeah. Zocala Island. <laughs> Listen. Like, if it was like, called Zoc Island, I think more people would yeah, watch yeah, it. That yeah. been, listen, you had to. I, I did a deep dive, guys. The action, the season is available on Hulu if you want to watch. Yeah, check John it out. Tony. Check it out. This it's isn't really an ad, by the way. <laughs> it was, but yeah. it was fascinating. It was yeah. all. It should have been Zocala Putana yeah. Island. <laughs> what it is is like oh there's, there's a bunch of guys and girls get sent to a villa who's in Spain, and you're supposed to couple up, and then whoever the best couple will win the show, and you win some yeah. money at the end. But we so you guys just try all flavors. Basically. Yeah, yeah, but we didn't go on that. We don't get like it's not hard for us to find girls. I know it sounds big headed but like we didn't go on there to like find love or anything like that. it was right. just something to help promote us for later on yeah. we knew we was going to do our YouTube cooking channel afterwards uh -huh. and our website and it was just a good platform I yeah. can't help but ask this question I don't mean to sound crazy but did you guys ever like switch on a girl? Like, we all like you're messing with a girl. You're like, yeah. you know, let me, let me. You know? That's just no. We no. get asked this all the time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not. I think it's too weird. Yeah, too, weird. too, too weird. weird. That'd be too yeah, freaky. Because you guys got like matching tattoos too. Pretty besides, much. like yeah, some. Yeah, 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 yeah some yeah. are the same and some are different. Like, buy one, yeah. get one free. But yeah, we used, <laughs> we used to get like some are similar, like like Cupid and Psyche. You got the LA right in the middle of the arm. We just have like similar ones, but yeah. Different. Yeah. We were romantic or religious, most of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like typical Italian yeah. tattoos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, like, I don't think they look that similar. I think they look very different. I mean, I could definitely tell them yeah, apart. Yeah. I think now, as we've got older, you can tell us apart. Our yeah. hairstyles, we want to look more like each other we can do. Yeah. But when we was kids, you couldn't tell us apart at all. We had yeah. name tags, so we had long blonde curly hair. So yeah, you, you couldn't tell us about it. Yeah. So on Love Island, there was nobody that you would like introduce to your mother on that island? Definitely Absolutely not. not. We, no. got, we got kicked out. Yeah. So it's, it's amazing. You sure. guys are mean. No, 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 no. You guys are a little mean. 
it's, we were it's, it's, it's it was, intense, Sean. It's different, but like yeah. you go in there, they weren't the type of girls we were looking for. You know, there's not any like Italian what type of girls. girls do you Italian. look for? Oh, no, Italian? Italian. No, 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 yeah, yeah. we're Italian. No, no. no. we asked specifically if like a perfect type because you asked what what girl you want to go for in mm-hmm. there, and every as soon as we got in, none of them was our type yeah. for that. It was a, a great fun. We weren't going in there to find a girlfriend anyway, so it was one just, of them was, was like a, a platform. One of them was like a drunken British sailor. <laughs> <laughs> I think all oh, woman. It was a like woman? this is the show. This is the show. You're a cheeky bastard. Oh well, she's a slut. Like it was just like. <laughs> Back, and I have to watch like a couple episodes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is good, good fun. It's, it's, good it's fun. gotten even bigger now. We was on the first series. Um, yeah. The first season? Like yeah, the first season. Oh, sure. We was on the first yeah. season. So now it's, I think it's on like seven or eight or something mm. like that, but it's absolutely gone bigger and bigger every year. It's yeah. massive. How was the reaction like coming from an Italian family when... Um, you were on like a reality show. Yeah, like, our parents effect. didn't obviously want us to go on no. because of the type of show it was, but like we knew we were going to be respectful on there. We weren't going to yeah. do anything on there that would like, you know, disrespect the family or anything yeah. like that. So it is what it is. But like we got a lot of hate coming off the show just yeah. because of we went in there like the bombshells to cause all the trouble, take the girls off the guys type yeah. thing and everything. But we knew we were going in set up like the bad boys to go in. Yeah. Yeah, it was, it was good fun. We got a lot of hair, but it was all fun. It was we, a, we let it say what I've done back to us. We, we, you you don't want to read the comments? No, I love anything? it. It doesn't bother me. But, but the thing is, it affects. I, I think it's funny. Yeah, the thing yeah. is, you go on a show like that, you need to have thick skin. You're going to yeah. get uh-huh. like some abuse afterwards and yeah. stuff said, but you know, you're going into that show, you know, you're going to get it. So mm-hmm. it was a lot like Jersey Shore. There was exactly like yeah, 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 or like real world, like yeah, yeah, like one of those kind of shows. Yeah, Big Brother or The Bachelor. Yeah, but except it's a lot of singles. Yeah, yeah. Did like the producers mess with you guys like did they no. tell you like this no, really like everything you? You, everything you say is what comes out of your mouth it's set up in a certain way because it's an entertainment show so it's got to be set up like staged a little bit but everything you say is like your emotions and feelings are all you know legitimate i mean these yeah. are heavily edited shows though. yeah yes. so it's like it's 24 hours a day you know, a lot can yeah. happen in 24 yeah. hours so yeah, and that's condensed and also I, I bet for you guys too it must be a lot to like wake up Brush your teeth and the cameras in your face. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Like, like you'd be shower. there. There's cameras <laughs> everywhere around, and then at some point, it's a guide running with a camera on his shoulder. Yeah. You're like, oh shit! Like this is real. Like yeah, you, you forget. You actually forget you're on a reality TV show, so you just like, start acting normal. They think, oh no, like I'm actually on a TV show here. You need to like watch what you're saying. You don't yeah. really yeah. do silly things and that. But yeah, it's a lot of fun. I, it was great fun. It's more but intense it, than you think because you're yeah. there and you're trying to like couple up with girls and stay uh-huh. in the show and everything. But you know. So that that was in 2015, yes. right? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. And then the transition to like doing what you guys are doing yeah, today. Yeah, so we've, always wanting to, we've always been cooking. We've grown up about cooking with our nonna, our parents and things, and we've learned traditional meals. Yeah. So we knew going on that show, it's going to be a great platform for us, great publicity. Mm-hmm. So obviously when we come off, we set up our blog, thealbertatwins.com, we set up our YouTube. And then from there, we got contact, contacted from NBC. So oh, that's great. when we come out to today show. So we was out yeah. early very next year. Just been going on ever since. Yeah, yeah. We've done lots of shows. We went over to Los Angeles, did the home and family show, then went over to yep. Toronto, did lots of TV shows over there. So yeah, yeah. We've been around a bit. How's how's the Italian scene in England? Because uh, you know, I really didn't know how many Italians were in England until yeah. like we played England in the Euro finals. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you see Italians celebrating yeah, in yeah. England and like yeah. getting beat up and shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, explain to somebody who's never been to England and yeah. you know. Italians that are curious because we're all yeah. over the world. But yeah, yeah, yeah. How is it being Italian in England? It's different. Like, there's a lot of Italians in England, mainly Sicilian, and uh, they'll all come mm. over from Sicily. Uh-huh. Um, but yeah, there's lots of Italians. A lot of them are either born there or they're just coming fresh, like off the boat. You know, that's what Why it is. Why would but Sicilians want to go to England where it's rainy and cold yeah. all the time? They like it for some reason. They, they like need to work. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That is a lot yeah, of it. Yeah. Is work. They all just come over to work, so they're working yeah. all the restaurants over there. But yeah, there's a lot of Italians there. The food's very traditional Italian as well. Like. It's different to like the Italian American food that you have, mm. have over here. We don't have that over in England. No, I much prefer the food over here. Yeah, I, I heard. I heard you guys like, like red sauce. Like yeah, red yeah, yeah. sauce Italian. Of course, yeah. we like. We love. Obviously, our more food's more European, but yours has got like an American twist on it. Yeah. Um, but I do like the American Italian food. I yeah. think like chicken parm. Yeah, 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 yeah. We don't have that in England. Yeah. Yeah. We have a big community of Italians, like down in London. In uh, is Bedford is one of the. Yeah, because I heard like not a lot of like. There's not like good Italian restaurants no, in England. No, no. that's why there's we, a very few. But there's a couple. Not, yeah, there's a yeah, couple, but the rare. majority aren't the best. And yeah, that's it's why not we like prefer cooking at home. We can we yeah. cook better meals than going into the yeah, restaurant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so we don't go out. If we go out to eat, we probably won't go to an Italian. And you know, much because you know, when we can cook better, why am I going there paying for food? You know. Yeah, exactly. 
What I was going to say, what's like a typical English dish? Because we just say fish and chips, right? Like, no, yeah. we have like, you know, like a Sunday roast. Sunday roast? Oh, so like a, like a roast beef. Yeah, 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 yeah. roast yeah. beef. Yeah. Yeah. That's Shepherd's proper gravy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are like real gravy. Real gravy. Not, 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 not yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they should make like a meatball shepherd's pie. How would you do that? That's like an English Italian fusion. That's what we do. How would you, how would you do that? And the meatballs on the bottom and then yeah, like the mash on the bottom. So like little yeah. miniature yeah. meatballs? Sure. Not the big, not no. like. Oh, no. Let's get crazy. You know? <laughs> little like, chiquito ones? Yeah. Because you have like shepherd's pie, cottage pie, they're very traditional. Yeah. Um, I don't know if red sauce and mashed potatoes would go good though. It's potatoes. It goes with everything. No, but you do it with a gravy You'd sauce. You'd have to do a gravy yeah, sauce. Like a brown sauce. Yeah, you do no, brown you sauce. Do red sauce. I don't know if it worked with Rosella is a red sauce enthusiast. Yeah, I love it. I love yeah. Rosella's a good cook, right? You got She's it. a great cook. I need to try your food then. Some people say. She never cooked for me. It is a good food. I'm going to some food here yeah, today. Yeah, yeah, it's it's I know, at least. I bring. All right, Rosella, this is what we're going to do. Right after this episode, <laughs> we're going to go to the supermarket, buy everything oh, Rosella needs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only go to Captain right on the table. The only thing is, we don't have a mapina for her. You know, in her cooking videos, she puts yeah, like. Yeah, uh, yeah. We got it. You got aprons. Oh, there we go. You, oh, got, right. the you got like the nona vestalia. That's we'll right. make it work. Yeah, yeah. So when um, Rosella first to- like told me about you guys, I'll be honest, I didn't know who you were. Yeah. So me, you know, this is. I don't is, think he's the kind of guy that's gonna follow. No, no, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. women. Yeah. I will. I will now. Yeah. I will now because I, you guys are really cool and you know, like great energy, and um, you know, when I go to England, I know you guys. Got what I'm looking for, so yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> you talking, yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, you know, what she told me about you, me, of course, this is a small situation, so I do all the homework myself. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I'm looking at your cooking videos, and um, I told Rosella this story. So you guys made a arabiata pasta video mm-hmm. that yeah. I saw, yeah. and I look and I see that you guys cooked, and I was like, "This isn't al dente. This is all mushad." <laughs> and then, like, I look at more, and um, what you guys talk about is like anybody could cook, and you guys like really push that yeah like, definitely listen also, even if you're not the greatest cook yep. you yeah. can learn yeah. so yeah, exactly. That's it really I mean. made sense once i like yeah. started really and like we're not, we're not saying with chefs you know we don't work in the kitchens we're home cooks and we like to say we want to promote home cooking enough yeah. and get all the families involved like the more generations going now we're losing the art of cooking and especially like traditional mm-hmm. recipes and yeah. the culture of italian food so we want to keep promoting that and keep that going and that's why we do all these youtube videos just mm-hmm. to like keep all the traditional recipes going and showing like especially for the kids growing up now teaching yeah. them how to cook and the traditional recipes as well yeah. they actually went to nigeria what the hell did you guys go do in nigeria <laughs> we had a, yeah so we had a we have a food agent so she contacted us and there's a big and you don't realize how big and foodie is nigeria yeah. there's a massive food festival out there of course yeah. so it was in uh, lagos nigeria and they um booked us onto their show so it was an hour cooking show in front of like a 500 audience and they're really into the food nigeria yeah the it's culture is very similar event. it's like when you go over there it's exactly what you see on tv like nigeria is like but the culture over there they're very um protective over their traditional recipes yeah. and everything they like and they're very family oriented like the italians as well so it's, it's very interesting for us to go over there and see that a lot yeah, of nigerians so cool. go to italy too yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. there's Lots, a big yeah. like uh yeah. You know, um, it, like a lot of tour, like yeah. people from Nigeria have been yeah. moving to Italy. So yeah. like, one of my friends is a Nigerian Italian, so right. okay. and he yeah. told me so much about it. So yeah. That's yeah. Why yeah. And the food's good over there. The, the local food food's nice. really good. What's like a typical Nigerian? Like jello chicken and jollof rice. Jello. Like yellow, like yellow rice? Or? Jello. Jello. It's like a spicy, spicy rice, rice that they do oh, with yeah. lots of mixed so herbs. It is nice. It's really it is good. nice food. But they're so into it. It was like, but they don't know much about Italian food because you have like different cuisines. You had mm-hmm. when we was obviously cooking Italian food, then you have like the Indian and English and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And they didn't even know like how to cook pasta. And we was thought they'd all know about this. So we had to so tell them. Like, they don't have pasta or did it? No, they, they did have noodles. noodles, noodles. Yeah, 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 they don't so they know do like noodles. typical things of like really simple things. So it was really training them. Yeah, it was back to like basic. Really basic, but it was good. It was very interesting. Very interesting. Such a amazing experience. Yeah, yeah really I'm cool. sure they don't reuse pasta water there. That's no, like no, no, no. that's like an expert. That's yeah. like when I went to con- I went to um what the hell? Sorry, how unprofessional! Come on, I'm sorry. Put it in the bucket over yeah. there. I'll throw it. Okay, no. Yeah. Um, so when I went to uh, Indiana, it was like what I the hell did you do in Indiana? Oh my god, they had an Italian festival in Indiana. Yeah. They could afford to bring me out there, so they did. Oh, so they had the budget. Okay. <laughs> They had the budget. I got driven around in this crazy Hummer. Like they probably, I don't know where the hell they rented this thing, but then they set up this ghetto like table for me at the festival and uh-huh. I made like orecchiette with broccoli rabe. They'd never seen broccoli rabe. Or, like, and you put sausage too? Or yeah, I did, they were like, I have not heard of that. Like they, I, you had to start from like, like, okay, now you put yeah. the salt, like salt everything. Mm-hmm. Don't, you know, yeah. this is what al dente is. It's really cute to see people it's like that. It's good because they're interested as well and they learn as well from yeah. all that. But listen, that's why food content does so good. Yeah. Like, 
tutorial stuff like that because yeah. Now with YouTube, people are constantly like searching mm. recipes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Searching yeah. Stuff it's all like on social media. It's just getting so bigger and bigger, and, and that's what's good about social media. Everyone's doing twists on all different types of food. You're getting seen lots of different ways of putting stuff together now, so you're learning so much more now. It's all visual yeah. as well, which is really it's good. It's so, so easy to get the access to it as well. You just go on YouTube, type any recipe you want, mm. and you can get access to it yeah. straight away. Obviously, ours is the best to go to. <laughs> <laughs> so let me ask you: being you know content creators, I'll yeah. say now, from being on a TV show yeah. now to content creators. Your parents, being like they were born in Italy, mm. do they understand what you guys do? Wait, were your parents born in Italy? Our parents were born in England. Okay, so yes. your grandpa, yeah, yeah, so you know what I mean. Yeah, but yeah. still, so your parents are probably like still like, you know, blue collar, like yeah, 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 yeah. regular yeah. job. And now they see it's, you guys it's like... It's all a big shock, everything, because especially going on a reality TV, TV show, they've never seen anything like that before. Do you know yeah. what I mean? And, and they, they, they don't understand like the social media side yeah. of it as well. Like, we have to help them with their phones, like yeah, using yeah, their phones yeah, and yeah. stuff. So it's like they're very, very old school in that sense. Well, because you guys are the babies, right? Yeah. We've got two older sisters. So we're the, um, yeah, Caroline and Lisa, they're 10 and 8 years older than us, and we're yeah. obviously the babies. The, the only one had one of us, and then obviously got, two came yeah. along. Oof, hit, hit the jackpot. Fo- boom. After <laughs> 10 years, twin boys. Twin boys. Well, and that was, that was a crazy night that turned up. <laughs> 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 Sabino has a set of twins. Yeah, I was so yeah. Yeah. So Boy cool. and a girl. Yeah. That was really cool. Yeah. Yeah. How old are they? They're six and a half. Right. Yeah, so good. being a twin, do you guys like ever, like if, he, if you're having a bad day, does your brother feel it and like calls you like is everything We've all right? Never, I don't for personally I've never felt that before. I, don't know that, does, like, twin, I think that. twins are very different to like siblings. There's a different yeah. connection that you have there as well. Mm-hmm. So like we do think the same. Like yeah. we like people, we'll both like them if we hate them, we'll both yeah. hate them as well. But like even when we're together, I know what he's thinking kind yeah. of oh before I'll say something, he'll know I'm gonna say that kind of thing. We never like when he's down, I feel down from a different part of where yeah. we are, but it's just um we've got more telepathic like that. How was it in school? Like you guys got mm-hmm. all the attention being the yeah, twins? Yeah, we used to have like especially like when we was in like preschool like the primary school we call it in England and we had like name types it was very identical then was naughty kids like cheeky naughty yeah. not like bad naughty but yeah, yeah it was naughty kids um, in school but yeah it was good fun like we used to all like we used to swap classes sometimes and the teachers yeah cause see know. like they, they in my kids school now they always try to separate them in the yeah, classes yeah, yeah, and yeah. I'm like now nah, yeah. let them be together. Yeah, exactly. They're gonna be separate. Yeah, like yeah, they want to be independent. Naughty, so yeah, yeah, they want it to be independent for some reason. But the twins, for a reason, they gotta say yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. So, so. Be, if you were an identical twin, be scary. <laughs> you would be taking uh, having somebody else take your, your test for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That totally would have been. Well, like, I mean, my brother would be like, "Go oh, screw yourself." <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like, "I'm gonna send my brother." Like, yeah, I'll send my brother. Yeah, I, I wish. I wish I had. Uh, I was saying yesterday is like, man, I could really use some help, like another Sabino. Yeah. How many siblings you got? I have one younger sister. That's it. The one just, yeah, yeah, the one just met. Oh, okay, cool. I gotta ask uh, a fun question. Rosella might not like this one, oh, but um. I was say, well, so <laughs> you guys are English, and you know England and Italy got this whole thing with football. Mm-hmm. So I gotta ask, you know, who are you guys rooting for? World Italy. Cup final? Oh, Italy, Italy all the time. Uh, we saw say, say, we saw some... say whoever's winning will root for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Always Italy. Well, yeah. always see, Italy. see, like me, what I'll do is like for football. I'll root for Italy, but then basketball I'll root for USA. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, that's yeah. right. Because they're going to win. You know, little Italians, you can't play basketball. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. 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 we're we born in England, but we're Italian. We see ourselves as Italian. We don't see ourselves as English at all. Like yeah. we're so brought up Italian. Our blood's Italian. We're from Italy. All of our ancestors are from there. So we yeah. obviously we got the accent. And we're born there. We we're brought up in a very like traditional Italian family as well. Yeah. You know, growing up. So like going to school. You know, we did we've. Their culture and every, you know, in England as well is very different to it. That's why yeah. we never really dated like English girls because they didn't really understand what we were like. Like I couldn't and because they can't cook. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. yeah, we'd have, have to, to cook teach for them. them to cook. Babe, would you like the pork roast today? <laughs> <laughs> No, I like takes a lot. Italian women yeah, yeah. don't don't cook in Italy anymore either. Though. They so do, they do. No, they do. They're no, losing the that tradition. So, they need to keep that going. Yeah, the men got so good at cooking, we took it away from yeah. the women. Now they, they can't <laughs> cook anymore. We had to do it. Yeah. That's, That's funny. <laughs> okay, but football clubs, you guys. What, what team are you? What's your favorite? I team? I don't follow it as much as you used to. We watch like the national teams, Italy, and things like that. No, but the world Chelsea, on it, really. we'll watch it. But yeah, like local like teams. Chelsea. We used to like Chelsea because they used to have all the Italian players on yeah. back in the day. Um, like, but, like who? Like Zola, oh yeah, 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 that's right, that's right, that's right. Casaraghi, I think. Yeah, they yeah. Played, uh, yeah. So we had lots of them, but yeah, we watch the World Cup and the Euros and stuff, and support Italy all the way. Yeah. 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 Okay. And do you like any sport like um, club teams in Italy? Like, do you prefer any team? I like you- Juventus. Yeah, Juventus is a typical Italian yeah, team. Yeah. Roma likes Totti used to play yeah. for Roma. Roma's cool. Roma's yeah, a cool yeah. city. Yeah. 
I'm a fan of it. Where are, how often do you guys go to Italy? Because you say you're from Florence, Yeah, yeah right? our, our parents have a place out there, so we go every summer. Um, we have a place where our, in the village where our nonna um, lived. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we're just about an hour, just over an hour from Florence north. We're in the middle oh, of nice. nowhere. Just like in a village, like 200 people. Like it's very remote. It's 200 like, people? Yeah, around that. That's very small. Because mine's 2,000 people and it's yeah, small. Yeah, very yeah, Sansa, small. Forget about it. Yeah, yeah. Sansa, see, she knows now. <laughs> I think we're like 2,000 feet above sea level in the middle of nowhere. But it's yeah. beautiful, it's peaceful. Like, yeah. it's relaxing. Good air for you. Like, really Sansa, food. we got more goats than people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> like, yeah, I actually yeah. prefer to hang out with the goats because yeah, they're yeah, like, I think it was a better to hang around with than people. Yeah. I think the Britalians have more of a connection to Italy because it's like an hour away. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You can yeah. get there. We can get so easy. What would a flight an hour away? What's that, sorry? Like, it, with a flight, it's yeah. an hour. Yeah, flight, two, two hours. hours. But two it's hours. like, for us going to Florida. It's like us it's going like to Miami. Six hours or something for you guys to go to Italy, right? Eight. No, nine. Oh, eight, really? nine. Yeah, yeah. it depends. Eight, eight, and it, yeah. It's eight going, nine coming back. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because we're like, we're European Italian, so we're, we're over there all the time. Yeah. It's very easy I mean, to get to. Like, you'll see, when well, you're there, you have to see family all the time, so it's not even like a holiday. You're going there, everyone's seeing the family all the time, yeah. so you need That's what I'm like a little jealous about with Europeans is like... It's so easy. Yeah. Go anywhere. We go to like... Let's say we go to Florida. You said they could go to Spain, Italy, mm, you know, France, Belgium, yeah, France. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two out, same exact thing. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. it's all it in is looking at that. Yeah, mm-hmm. that. we could go to like Pennsylvania. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's I mean, sexy. I know, right? Uh, you ever so, been to Pennsylvania, guys? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> they just go. These guys just like L.A. and New York. L.A. and New York. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. So, what about Florida? Yeah. Have you guys been to Florida? Went to Florida. Kid went to Universal kids, Studios as kids. Oh, Orlando. Yeah, yeah. Yes, oh, Orlando. Oh, it's like yeah, Disney. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. You guys look like Miami guys. Miami. Yeah, they yeah, look yeah. like they would have the best table in the club. Fifteen bottles. They get in trouble in Miami. Twenty thousand dollars minimum. I've always wanted to go to Miami, but I've never been. Never been? No, never, never been. been. No, you, never been. Would li- you, would like, you would like Miami. Yeah, it'd be cool. Do you guys like to party or not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's party. Yeah, like you like the club situation. Yeah, yeah. I hate the clubs. What about but you? Not as much as the clubs are more like as we got older. We still love clubs. We still like going out to bars and things, but more restaurant bar yeah. kind of type and mm-hmm. vibe. More chilled a bit. Not like the nightlife. Not, not like the raves. Like raves. Not raves. I'm not going to raves. raves. Who goes to raves? Oh, In England, raves. 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 Yeah. raves. When I think yeah, of raves, yeah, I think of possible. like. Like after hours, like yeah. you see a lot of creatures yeah, in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, yeah. that's a whole other yeah. thing. Definitely more just restaurant type. Yeah. What one other thing? Um, you know, being that you guys are from England, I notice like a lot of English people pronounce the Italian food so bad. Yeah, like from them. Like no, but I'm just I'm just saying like. <laughs> You know how like uh, Italian Americans like a lot of our contents about like making fun of pronunciations. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Because yeah. over here you're like, like oh, you over here you'll say like mots, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so like word. you abbreviate everything. Yeah, yeah exactly, like, exactly. You do that yeah. purpose like as a joke, like to joke around, yeah. Gabagool. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah like yeah, yeah. I, I, we, do, me, I know for me for sure is like. It's gonna sound crazy, but like sometimes we do it because like, all right, let's get a couple of views, you know? Let's, yeah, let's, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a cheap right? shot. Right, right. You gotta do it. You, you gotta, gotta do, do it sometimes. It. Yeah. So, but like, when you guys hear that, do you like correct people? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's not always. mozzarella. It's yeah. mozzarella. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even like, there's also restaurants called like Chibo over in England, and they'll go Cibo, and then like sometimes I'm like, it's, it's Chibo, yeah, yeah. it's Chibo, you know? Like, you have Somet- to correct I can't, someone. Sometimes I ain't got the heart, and I just let them think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do people say espresso in England? Some no, do. No, they say they say tea. Yeah. Some will say like espresso. You know, do, you guys, do you guys do English tea or like you not? We have the that? afternoon tea. Really. You know, really. in England, no, obviously. your parents don't stop at four o'clock and like put the tea out. No, yeah, not like an afternoon whole, tea. No. Well, I wonder I don't what the whole tea hype like is like about. Anything. Okay. I think it's do you like afternoon tea. No. Because you, you have know, like, like scones, scones and jam yeah, yeah. and well, yeah, I know cream. You, you get snacks and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Like snacks. so scones, okay. Like it's popular jelly. in England, like for the restaurants, will do like an afternoon so tea. So when you say afternoon tea, it's basically like after lunch, before dinner, it's four like a little snack. You could, no, you can do it like 1 p.m. You can do it 1 p.m. You I can do it 4 o'clock. No, no, you can do it like 1 p.m. But you have like little finger sandwiches to come out on a little like cute little plates. And this stuff sounds like I'm not going to get full from this. No, you wouldn't. You're starving after It's like a little snack. No, no. I need like a panino. You want to get dinner after it. Yeah, let's get Savino a water crack. This is like a let's Delicious. fill the cavity. It's like a let's fill the cavity. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. But um, do you guys do like iced teas too, or is it got to be hot? Um, I like ice- my frappuccinos. It's, yeah, it's getting more popular in England now, like the iced teas and everything. But because the weather's cold, we just want hot I don't like drinks. Ice you know what I mean? So it's I like. like a, I always get a, from Starbucks a hazelnut frappuccino. I was just gonna ask if there's a lot of Starbucks. Yeah, yeah, lots, yeah, I love yeah. Starbucks. I like Starbucks. Yeah, it's getting more popular now, especially all the drive throughs Like years ago, we didn't have drive through like Starbucks and everything. Like mm-hmm. over in like LA and everything, obviously it was really popular. But it's
Well, all right, I got a couple of questions for them. It's going to be like a this or that. <laughs> I think like very Italian, considering yeah, yeah, yeah. that they're English. Yeah, like, they're very, they're very Italian. Italian. Like, they, look, they look very American. Italian, too. <laughs> well, I, I, I am very Italian. Yeah, you've been in America, though. Yeah, but it's, I, really, it's crazy how like you you're so are... far from Italy, but even in America, they're very, very the culture Italian. is still very Italian. That's a good thing, though. That's so even clever. for the generations, you still It's kind of like a resurgence, too. But they're arguably less Italian. They're their second generation, you know, like they're the grandchildren of immigrants. I'm a child of immigrants, mm-hmm. and it's. I feel like where it's our Italian level is pretty much the same. Like we're yeah. pretty much here. You know? Yeah. 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 You know, I feel no, like I would agree. I would agree. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's just. It's just a. They also have culture. the look too. Like yeah. Yeah. that helps. You know. It's they look like nice. they look like zips. Doesn't hurt them. Yeah. <laughs> they they would. They, they could, look like uh like stars on a national team. We like, could throw Fila <laughs> sweatsuits on both of these guys. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> I mean, they they look look I think I think so too. Yeah. <laughs> they look like two guys at Tiki Bar in Staten Island. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me see your fist pump. Holy day. So I'm gonna ask you guys like couple of questions and I want you to say like pick one or the yeah, other yeah, okay. okay quick fire round yeah. right <laughs> Peaky Blinders or Sopranos Sopranos yeah Sopranos well I was not expecting that yeah, yeah. Sopranos yeah Classic. Okay. It's What's a classic. What? It's like uh it's Yeah, you guys explain it. It's um it's based in Birmingham and it's like old school world in the in the oil mines and like the industry, the heavy industrial industry. But it's like a root of where one of the guys is trying to make it big time. It's like an English like mafia gangster. show. Yeah, yeah. kind of oh, like a gangster. It. It's good, it's, it's good, really, really good. It's good. It's, really good. Good. it's, good. it's, it's good. good. And uh the actors are all amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, good. really good. All right, so I was surprised with that one. I'm you not understand gonna the accent on Peaky Blinders. Yeah, yeah. 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 Burger, I mean, Romeo. I'm also the guy that like when it's perfect English, perfect. Well, not, I can't say perfect English because we speak American English yeah. and it's like completely different. But like, even if I understand every word, sometimes I put the subtitles on because yeah. like really? I just like yeah, yeah. I have like. So it's a mild like ADD. It. The Brummie accent is very yeah. strong. It's like from Manchester and Birmingham's like about, I don't know, two hours away from yeah. us. Um, but it's a total different place. Like, the accent strong. is so strong. But we speak fast. Like, I have to slow myself down in America. The amount of times I go on shows and they don't understand what I'm saying or they think I'm Scottish. Uh-huh. I don't know the sort of random accents or something. <laughs> I like thought that. you were Scottish. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we get it all the time, but I have to, Tony talks a bit slower than me, but I talk really fast. I have to slow myself uh, down. He got really yeah. mad. He's like, I'm bloody English. Ooh. Like, I'm like, we'll okay, relax. I'm bloody English. Scottish, Australian. Never we get it. Oh, okay, yeah. one more, one more. Espresso or afternoon tea? Espresso. espresso oh my god. Hundred percent espresso. Okay. Team espresso. They're Italian. They're Italian. Team okay. espresso. Don't, don't even say you're English. Just say you live there. That's hey. it. You guys just live there. You're not. You're yeah, not. yeah, yeah, exactly. We live yeah. there. Um, <laughs> we obviously, we're born there, but we spend a lot of time in Italy all the time. Yeah. On um, we, if things have changed. You'd, I'd love to live in America. It's a cool yeah. place. There's one more guy I want to bring up in this uh, interview that I, I'm really a big fan of. And uh, whenever we post him, like, the reactions are crazy. Like, people love him. But Gino Campo? Gino, Gino De Campo. Campo. Gino yeah. De Campo, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, Gino yeah, De Campo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, he does, the, like... Uh, he's big in England. Yeah. 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 So, he's got to be, like, the, one of the biggest, like... English Italian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, yeah he's, he's, um, he's. You know who I'm talking about? I don't know. Who he is. You don't know Gino? Yeah, yeah, he's a. He's you would love yeah. him. Yeah. He's so there's like there's like this uh from a from a cooking show that they're making lasagna, uh-huh. and then um you know it's him and like two people from England and they're like, I love to add a little dollop of sour a salad cream on yeah, top yeah, yeah. of my lasagna and he goes que schifo, <laughs> que schifo <laughs> like and. Like yeah, he's a funny guy. When yeah. we posted that, we got like yeah, ten yeah. million views. Like yeah, people yeah. went nuts for yeah. it. Yeah, he's, he's very popular because wow. he's yeah. fun as well. We'll go on the TV yeah. shows and he's funny as well. That's what like we try and do when we're cooking. Have you met him? Fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. When, they, up in when you guys cook though, everything has sexual innuendo. Yeah, we want to because we want we want to make cooking fun as well. Yeah, so we yeah. want to appeal to certain we audience. We want the like, younger generation to be cooking. At the moment, there's a lot of older guys who make it boring. It's like anyone could do it. Like, so give me an example. Reason, what do they do? No, because there's a reason that they've been on the Today Show like eight times. Okay, <laughs> and I'm I've never been on the Today Show. You live here. Well, just because they go there and make the sausage. Yeah, they, like they here's a sausage. There. There's a sausage joke and everything. If God forbid, if they make sausage or balls of any kind, forget about it. See, all right. So you got to stick to like doing the clam. And they got yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. the sausage on the cat. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah. <laughs> meatballs on the show, with the sausage on the show, anything that gets good. We love a sexual in you, I know. It's funny, yeah. it makes laughing. Like, it, it sets the tone for it. You we know, we want to make one. cooking fun as well. So we can find a sexual in you, in anything. Yeah. The one that where they made like. 
meatballs on the Today Show, I, it's like I should have played a drinking game where every somebody, time they said balls, I would yeah. drink. I would have been whacked by the end so of the four so many ball minutes. jokes. He's put that on the And then, you know, like, Hoban and Kathy out. Lee yeah. are, like, giving them their underwear at the end of the clip. They're like, all right, guys, take these. No, it's a good laugh. Yeah, you, you, got, you guys are great, man. I really, I really like, I'm um, glad Rosella set this up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm happy we did this. Um, before we go, what what's next for you guys? Like, do you have anything? Uh... Yeah, so we we uh, published our cookbook a couple of years ago now. So we got our second cookbook coming out. So it should oh, be great. out probably early next year as well. Um, more TV shows. We're doing lots of cooking festivals in England. Uh, yep. More TV shows that we'll be doing as well. We eventually want to start opening our own restaurants as well. Okay. Pizzerias. Maybe so we'll have nice. some good restaurant, Latin restaurants in England. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. We'll be the best. <laughs> we need then, yeah. it. So yeah, that's the next step that we'll be doing that. Definitely yeah. open up our own places, yeah. And All big uh, things to come, definitely. For everybody watching too, we'll put like your Instagram yeah, in the yeah, description. Yeah. Make yeah. sure to follow them. But well, your yeah. first cookbook is actually available in the US. Yes. yes. Yeah. Where could I get that? Yeah, Amazon. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so it's an American publisher, so yeah, on Amazon you'll be able to get it. All right, guys. Twintastico. Twintastico. Make sure to dive in on some of their YouTube videos. They're great. Yeah, super, super. Love uh, Island. Uh, <laughs> love uh, Well, you know, let, let's get to the YouTube first because you know they. <laughs> they get some love from that. Yeah, but exactly. thank you guys so much for coming. No, Rosella, thank, you, thank you for setting it up. Sure. Thank Ciao. You. Ciao. 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 Ciao.